CompTIA A Plus Core 2, 220-1102, Practice Exam. Questions 181 through 185. This video is part of our practice exam video series and is filled with questions that closely resemble the real exam. So are you prepared to test your knowledge? Great, let's begin. Question 181. A technician is called to assist with a computer that is running unusually slow. Upon arrival, they observe that the hard drive activity light has been continuously on for over an hour. To diagnose the issue using Task Manager, which tab should the technician check to identify the cause of the high disk usage? The answer is, A. Processes. The Processes tab in Task Manager provides a detailed view of all running applications and background processes, including their resource usage such as memory, CPU, disk, and network. By examining this tab, the technician can identify which processes are consuming the most disk resources, which can help pinpoint the cause of the high disk usage and degraded performance. Question 182. A designer has been working on a project using their macOS device and needs to frequently access and restore previous versions of their files due to constant updates and revisions. Which feature should the designer use to ensure they can easily access multiple versions of their files? The answer is C. Time Machine. Time Machine in macOS is specifically designed to provide a comprehensive backup solution. With Time Machine, you can backup files on your Mac that weren't part of the macOS installation, such as apps, music, photos, and documents. When Time Machine is turned on, it automatically backs up your device and performs hourly, daily, and weekly backups of your files. Question 183. A company is implementing new security measures to protect its data. As part of this process, employees are required to use multiple forms of authentication to access the company's network. Which of the following setups demonstrates the use of MFA? The answer is, D. Smart Card and Password. Multi-factor authentication, or MFA for short, requires the use of two different factors from the following categories, something you know, such as a password, something you have, such as a smart card, and something you are, such as a fingerprint. The combination of smart card and password meets this requirement because it involves both a something you have factor and a something you know factor. Question 184. A company employee is trying to secure their Windows 10 home laptop by enabling a feature that encrypts the entire drive. However, when they open the control panel, they cannot find the option to enable this feature. Which of the following reasons explains why the employee is unable to find this option? The answer is, B. BitLocker is not included in the Windows 10 Home Edition. The Windows 10 feature that encrypts the entire drive, known as BitLocker, is not available in the Home Edition of the operating system. It is a security feature included in the Pro, Enterprise, and Education Editions. Therefore, if the employee is using the Home Edition, they will not find the option to enable BitLocker in the control panel. Question 185. A user's workstation with an HDD is experiencing significant slowdowns after a week of frequently opening, closing, and saving large files. Which of the following tools should a technician use to resolve this issue? The answer is, A. Disk defragment. Using disk defragment is appropriate for resolving slowdowns caused by file fragmentation on a hard disk drive, HDD. Fragmentation occurs when files are saved in non-contiguous sections, leading to increased read and write times. Defragmenting the disk reorganizes these fragmented files, allowing the system to access data more efficiently. This process is crucial for maintaining optimal performance on traditional HDDs, especially after extensive file operations. So, did any of these questions give you a tough time? Don't worry if they did, it's all part of the learning process. Luckily, Certification Synergy has a wealth of free video content at your disposal. 
To stay connected with our latest IT learning resources, just give a quick click on the subscribe button. This simple action ensures you're always updated about our newest video releases. Thank you for watching. Subscribe for more great content.